Hi guys, today we're going to talk about Omid's Kobe's book, Endgame. Yes, I'm going to make videos about it till the end because it's very interesting what has been written by him and the way that everybody is criticizing him, slamming him, it's quite interesting too. The only slam people that are saying things that might be true, the way everybody is after him, calling him names, I'm talking Britain, right? All the press, the media tabloid, and the royal commentators, royal experts are against him. Some of them haven't even read the book, but they are slamming him, slamming the book and criticizing it, which is quite strange because you can only criticize or pass a judgment or something that you've read. But according to them, no, they don't have to do that. So we're talking about him because he wrote a book about the royal family. It's not a book about Harry and Meghan, it's about the royal family. Prior to the book coming out, when it was announced that he would be publishing that at a certain date, the same royal commentator were saying that the royal family is ready to sue if he says something that's untrue, that's unclear, that's not correct, and things like that. And that they are ready, all the lawyers are out and are going to have a copy of that book to go through it and see if something isn't true, they will sue. This is what was said at the time. Fast forward two or three months later, the book is already out. At least some of the copies have reached Buckingham Palace and the media, the journalists, right? And so far, many complaints, but no lawsuits. How come? Did they not say that the royal would sue, the royal family would sue if they thought that what he wrote was incorrect in any way, if he slandered one member of the royal family, if it defamed the name of someone, right? The character of someone, right? So how come they haven't sued? They were very vocal about wanting to sue, but how come they haven't done it yet? Maybe, just maybe what he's saying is actually true, right? If they haven't sued. The funny thing is, what he said or what he says in his book is exactly what the same tabloids who are slamming him had said before. He's only telling us that through the lens of a critical analyst rather than a sycophant or psychophant like some of the media tabloids are. So there are no big revelation in there, according to some who've read the book. No big, but some, yes, some major, but not as explosive as Prince Harry's book was, right? He says what he says because he worked in the media, right? He knows how it works and he analyzes everything that has been said about the royal family by the same tabloid he was working for. That's what makes his work very interesting. Basically, what the fans are saying now is that if the royal family thought that he insulted Kate Middleton, he said lies about her, or Prince William for that matter, or Prince Charles, Camilla, they are free to sue. And the reason they haven't done it yet is because maybe what he's saying, it is the truth. Let me know what you think. Hope you liked the video. Feel free to click on like if it's the case. Subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell to be notified when I post a new video. Thank you.